here at the Actors tonight. It's very exciting because there's an amazing array of actors and actresses here and screenwriters and directors and it's been an amazing year for film and television and I'm really excited for everyone to see. Everyone scrubbed up and uh, yeah, on their best game. It's exciting because it's our night to celebrate um, our industry and We've got a record number of films out this year, so I think there's 38, and that's phenomenal for Australia to actually produce 38 films, so I'm just really proud to be a part of an industry that's thriving. I grew up with Australian stories. I mean, the only reason I'm an actor is because, you know, I grew up, you come home at four o'clock and before the news, your parents let you watch two hours of television or something, and it was Ocean Girl and Around the Twist, and I think, you know, it's really important for Aussie children to grow up with an idea of their own culture and the stories that are coming from their own country and not just be flooded from international content. It's a good celebration of 60 years. Um, of storytelling in this country and just at, it's at a place where you know we're, we're doing more more stories that are of different cultures we're diversifying and um, we're sharing stories with the world some of my favorite films in the last 12 months I mean obviously sweet country uh, mystery road I did watch breath Really love that. Bruce Berris's film Ladies in Black is amazing. Uh, Warwick Thornton's film Sweet Country is an absolute masterpiece. Well, Breath, for me, I just thought it was a really amazing, accomplished piece of work. I love watching Ladies in Black. You know, Bruce, knowing that he was making another film, it's just very exciting. It's just been a, it has been a really great year for uh, film. A really standout show for me was Safe Harbor. I really love the message of that show. I think Jerga was a pretty interesting film, you know, really setting the bar pretty high, like reaching for something. I think it's really exciting that more and more types of stories are being told. You've got so many diverse stories and I think that's really important. And slowly but surely our screens are reflecting our streets. We look and feel like ourselves and owning that with a confidence, which I think is really sexy and interesting. I'm excited about the future of Australian storytelling because I think there's more and more opportunities on the horizon. We're only just scratching the surface. And I think when we tell more stories about our diversity, we'll find a better understanding in this country and we're gonna move forward you know, as, as, as a mighty people. And we can show the rest of the world what we can do. We've got the talent. We just need the money and the audience to back us. Our television and film, tells the world about Australia and it does an enormous amount of valuable stuff for Australia. Uh, so we really need to invest in our industry. We want to see ourselves up there in whatever iteration that is. I'm so happy to be part of this industry and be able to keep giving back and keep sort of having it, um, I suppose, be, become bigger and bigger and bigger.